hello guys welcome to my channel again so if you are new to my channel please hit the subscribe button and let's continue this video so today we are going to talk about loops uh, we are not going to talk about specifically but we are going to do a challenge on loops there are two challenges so in this video we are going to cover on this one right so what it says let's see so it says it will uh, give us an integer uh, and we have to print its first 10 multiples so if you are in uh, if you are from india you uh, you might have heard about tables right uh, two stable three stable so that that is what we need to print and here is the catch uh, we have to print in the in the format like this right so this is uh, not big thing it's really simple so let's let's see how we can do it First, I don't understand uh, why they have to capitalize the uh, the variable name. It should be small. And here, if you see, they have imported regex. So again, this can be solved using regex. But I am going to show you a simple solution because not many people are good with regex and not many people understand it that much uh, better. So it will be more easier for us to work on the simple logic so that we can get the grasp of Java more easier. So what it says, we have to print in in an order. So see, here are more things that you will find as static, right? Like two is common here, x is common which is signifying a multiplication operator equals is common so that's why you can see like we can use a for loop and put the static content there and then do a var variable one the dynamic ones so we have to do int i equals to one because we have to print from two e into one then i less than 11 because up to 10 right and then i plus plus now we just have to do system dot out dot print ln so we will first put the static content so static content is first n n is static here right and then we need x like this so n uh, 2 into x is done then we need equals after this we need equals so this is 1 2 3 4 up to 10 this is our i right so we will do plus i and then we need equals so space equals space and then we need the actual outcome so which will be n into i so this is it this is what we have to do so let's try to run this so see it's working so let's try to submit this one great so it's a success so this is it for this video and I'm just two points away from my second star so I'm getting it much sooner than expected uh, but I'm hoping that uh, after the second star it, it is going to get tougher and tougher for me to get the gold one so it's a journey uh, and I, I expect like you can hit the subscribe button to help me out with the journey and I'm going to make more and more videos for you guys so this is it for this is it for this video and have a good day guys and bye bye